Hi. Well, first thing I'm going to do with this little video is give a plug to iShowU HD, which is the software that I'm using for this screencast. It cost me about 40 Kiwi dollars, which is about $30 US, and for that I can install it on both my iMac and my MacBook. So very good value, I reckon. When I ask questions, they reply promptly. And it includes this nice little feature to fade in and out a camera, which makes it a little bit more personal. Um, of course, you can see I'm a bit overweight and my hair's thinning somewhat, so, well, maybe not such a good idea. Okay, now I use drawing objects quite a lot in Microsoft Word and I find them very useful. Uh, when I do a diagram like this, which has a number of parts with lines and text boxes, then I often want to group them together so that I can then move them or copy and paste them easily into another uh, document or maybe into PowerPoint or whatever. Now, of course, you can do that by clicking on them individually with the command key held down. Oops. But that uh, is quite tedious when there's a large number of components. Once you've got them selected, you can then go to grouping and group them. But with this number of elements, that really is quite fiddly and too tedious. Now, I've done grouping multiple objects numerous times before with other versions. In Office Mac 2008, the Select tool is on the Drawing toolbar. Uh, but there's no Drawing toolbar here. The drawings are done a different way. And on Office 2007 for PC, the Select tool is, I believe, on the Home ribbon over on the right somewhere. But it didn't seem to be anywhere on Office 2011 for Mac, not on any toolbar or uh, on the ribbon or even directly on a menu. So, uh, although I searched on Google and YouTube, I couldn't find uh, how to do that for that, this particular version. Now you can see I've actually got it up here. If you recognize the icon, that's it. I've added it to the main toolbar because I like it nice and handy. use it quite a lot. do diagrams like this. This is a basic economics diagram because I'm an economics teacher. So how do you do it? Okay, view, toolbars, customize toolbars and menus. Make sure from the dialog box that comes up you choose commands. Then you've got to go down and find that select tool. It'll be shown as an icon here and with a name. So let's go down. It's somewhere around here, I believe. Select drawing objects. This is the one. Then you click on it and you can just drag it up onto the toolbar and it will add it in the next available space. I won't do it again because you can see that I've already done it before. So a bit fiddly but it doesn't take too long and you can put it in a place where it's nice and convenient. Okay, well, I hope that was helpful.